Hello YouTubers and welcome to the SJ Cam Review channel on YouTube powered by SJCamHD.com. Today we're doing a worldwide exclusive review and it's for the SJ Cam M20. And uh, we have a blue unit here. This is a prototype unit still, so there are certain uh, specs that we cannot confirm yet. The one thing that we can confirm is that it does have a 16 megapixel Sony IMX206 sensor. Before we get started, I just want to remind you guys to like our video, also subscribe. We will be uploading more footage from this unit, even though it is still prototype and then the firmware is still not uh, finalized. And uh, other M20 uh, reviews as well, so make sure to, to subscribe. And one another cool thing about this camera is that it is the smallest SJ cam to date. So it has an awesome form factor. So Here's the M10, and uh, you can see that this is totally like really like a lot um, thinner than the M10. So this would be a great camera to mount on your body as well, um, as it would not be as bulky. Now the M10 was already small, and um, you can see compared to the SJ4000, uh, it was uh, not as wide. So uh, again, it's the smallest SJ cam to date and it has a great form factor so uh, in this review we'll just uh, show you the build real quick and then uh, we'll power the unit on and show you some of the settings so the top here we have a power button a shutter button and uh, in the front here we have looks like we have we have some, we have indicator lights here for like when it's recording, I believe. So let's just uh, back indicator light. So let's try this. Okay, so I'm not exactly sure when this light turns on or if it has a light, but I'm pretty sure it does have one. So uh, yes, that. Okay, so for the ports, we have a micro USB. Micro USB, micro HDMI, micro SD card slot, 1.5 inch LCD screen. Now the CE will be probably on the bottom of the unit, so this will not have a CE there. Again, a back indicator light, speaker. Scroll up, scroll down. Oh, sorry, scroll up, scroll down. Wi-Fi right here, and it has a micro here on the side. Again, uh, front indicator light, I need to confirm what that's for. Looks like there may be another light up here at the top as well. And uh, battery uh, cover. So this set has actually a, it has a, a new battery uh, design. And you can see that this uh, the lid or, or the cover is fixed to the unit. So uh, I'll probably just leave the battery in. Uh, we could, we'll uh, show you that later. So nice, again, nice, great form factor, and 60 megapixel sensor at the, on the front, again, by Sony. And this is part of the unit on. on. So we may be uh, low on battery, a little bit lower on battery, so we'll just go through some of the, uh, and you can see it says M20. So we'll zoom in a bit. Now in this brochure that we, we actually had in this brochure out at, uh, at CES, and it says that it has an Amberella chip. Um, this could uh, very well be a Novatech chip, so uh, the, the chipset has not been confirmed yet. Six megapixel. So here's some footage I took, I think, at 2K, and I was at Tacos El Gordo on the, uh, on the Vegas Strip. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, that was a fun night. Anyways, we go to the menu. So we'll check out the resolution. So this is uh, only the 4K on this camera. It's uh, interpolated. So uh, it has two real 2K at 30 frames per second, though. 1080p at 30 frames per uh, 60 frames frames per second. Circle so record, which is uh, I believe loop record. FOV, so this has an adjustable FOV, just like the SJ5000X Elite. WDR, 
gyro sensor. Again, uh, this has not been confirmed yet, so uh, again, uh, we cannot confirm that, it, that the final production unit will have a gyro or not. Motion detection, audio, so you have a volume there. Date stamping or time, time stamping, TV out, mo TV mode, OSD mode, video lapse, which is uh, time lapse video, slow sumo view, which is actually slow motion. So again, we'll be uh, fixing some of these uh, menu. Uh, we'll be fixing some of these menu titles. White balance, burst mode. Car mode, which is a car dash cam, you can use this as a gas dash cam. License number settings, so this is actually a, a license. Uh, you can have have your you can uh, stamp your video with your license plate number. Language, so we'll scroll through all the languages for all of our international viewers. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So seventeen languages. Date time. Screen savers so is basically just uh, lets you uh, save the screen uh, like when it's active or it, it powers off or the screen goes black after this amount of time. So it's not really a screen saver per se. Frequency, default settings, version, so this is M20 plus it looks like, V1.0. So. Uh, now one thing about the FOV, it probably will have an optional FOV option, so um, it may be in a, in a later firmware release where the optional FOV, uh, if it's turned off, then uh, you, it'll actually support uh, digital zoom uh, as the 5000X added, so. Cool, so um, again, I want to remind you guys to like our video, also subscribe, we'll be up to, we'll be doing more reviews as we get more information on this M20 unit. So uh, feel free to ask any questions inside of our YouTube video description. Like our video, subscribe, and thanks for watching.